Millions of educators use Clever every day to help make digital learning work. Like any ed tech program, sometimes teachers or students need a little help. We've got your back. Let's talk about handling our most common troubleshooting issues and when to contact Clever versus when to contact an application partner for help. By the way, this video is for Clever Admin. If you're a teacher or student, please contact your tech support team for help. The three most common categories where Clever Admin most commonly need help are data is incorrect in Clever, such as missing users or classes, data is correct in Clever, but incorrect in an app, and a user is having trouble getting logged into a program accessed via Clever. First, let's tackle if data is incorrect in Clever. To start, ensure the data is correct in your Student Information System, or SIS for short. If the data is correct in your SIS, confirm the data is correct in the files being sent to Clever and matches the data requirements outlined at support.clever.com. For detailed support based on your sync method, you should check out our Help Center at support.clever.com. Simply search by entering the name of your SIS or sync type. Another common issue is that data is correct in Clever, but is incorrect in a Clever connected app. For example, a section or a student is not showing up in the application. To start, review that the user or section's information is correct in Clever. Next, confirm the user or section is being shared with the application by reviewing its profile page in Clever. If both look good, please contact the application so they can investigate on their side. Applications manage the process of pulling data from Clever to use in their system. A third common issue is when a user can't log into an app accessed via Clever. For example, they click on the application's icon in the Clever portal and the login fails. A great place to start is by using the Troubleshoot login tool, accessible from your admin dashboard. Just search for a user and click Support Tools, Troubleshoot Login. This tool will show you common issues, like if the user isn't shared with the app or isn't signing in via Clever. If the user isn't shared with the app, you can work through sharing permissions issues by using the Troubleshoot Sharing tool. Head to your Clever dashboard and go to Support Tools, Troubleshoot Sharing. From here, you can use the tool to determine why a teacher or student is not shared with the application. Please remember, after updating your sharing permissions, allow 24 hours for applications to sync the updated data from Clever and reflect the changes. After 24 hours, have the user try logging in again. If the user is being shared with the app and the Troubleshoot login tool doesn't find any issues in the Clever setup, it's likely a problem the application partner must resolve. Please reach out to that app support team directly for assistance. Of course, you can always contact Clever's support team for other questions. Head to support.clever.com and click the chat icon in the bottom right corner. Choose your role, explain your problem, and work through the prompts. If you're not able to solve the problem, you'll be put in touch with our award-winning team. On behalf of all of us at Clever, thank you for everything you do. You can always learn more about our support resources by heading to our help center at support.clever.com or heading to our training site, Clever Academy, by going to clever.academy.